Monday afternoon. Uh, nice to see you finally show up. Ken? What up? What's up? Oh, Ken's please. little brother is finally old enough to come around. When? Dude, sponsored by Jimmy John's and Ice Lattes. That's how we roll. They're the <laughs> polar opposite of Ken's. You scared him! <laughs> yeah! Woo! <laughs> Let's go! Life wide open, baby! That's it. Dude, those guys had a flag, and then the dad stands up and he has the shirt on, too. <laughs> I'll do a cannonball for the camera. Geez, Glenn, it's always about the camera with you. I'll do it right now if you film it. All right, guys, 4th of July, Pelican Lake. This is probably the only reason anyone around here actually lives here. For this one day, we love America, just like all you guys do back home. So we're gonna party and celebrate the way America should be celebrated. I apologize in advance for whatever Glenn does. <laughs> yeah. It's Ken's little brother. Hey, where's the chug buddy at? Evan wants to rip a couple. Hey guys, those kids bringing teas, you know. People are coming up left and right, so hopefully we'll see a lot of subs. And we got my boy Josh over here. Josh, what's up, what's up dude? It's gonna be a good day. It only seems right to start it out with Evan, chug buddy, and a tea. <laughs> Short, way too many people got on Tin's pontoon, and this floor is bending now. It wasn't supposed to happen, but it happened. And now Tin's pontoon is kind of and he's pissed. We should probably just go home. Yeah, I agree. This seems like a proper time to call it. Alright guys, so our friend Max at Gravity Coffee hit us up and they were like, hey, we got a bunch of fun stuff to do at our cabin up in the mountains in Washington. Do you guys want to come out? And we were like, hey, we like fun stuff. They were like, sweet, we'll send our private jet. We are like, oh shit, okay. So uh, yeah, we're on our way to the airport right now to private jet to Washington. Yeah. Ooh, let's go. Uh, wait, wait, hold on Q. Yeah, I feel like I'm at the tippy top of my game Looking down at the rafters I had to sun these boys, can't leave them bastards A lot of dudes, just some undercover actors I don't fall for it, I'm privy to all your tactics They knew Ryan was coming Just for you <laughs> Alright, I'll be your flight attendant today, Ryan I'm just gonna be in the toilet the whole time Just down Mountain Dew <laughs> Breakfast burritos, a side of ham, bacon, sausage home fries, funfetti pancakes, we've got blueberry pancakes, we have strawberry pancakes, regular pancakes, scrambled eggs. Do you guys have hot sauce? We do. Oh wow, I thought I was throwing you for a loop there. <laughs> we can like crash this plane and eat for two weeks. Just take the plastic cups out of the cup holders on the sides and put them in the Dude, Ryan is like, this is everything I dreamed of. Tell me I get to fly on a plane and drink unlimited Mountain Dew? <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget about it. Two hours and 45 minutes to hold that Mountain Dew. Is there a steamer policy? No steamers. <laughs> no yeah, steamers. No steamers. Just for respect of the entire crew, that's why Ken couldn't come. <laughs> he was like three hours of, I can't take a sh**. You can count me out, I'll meet you guys there if anything. This is why we can't be on nice things. CJ, you have one job. My guy, I was eating a burrito. I felt like I was falling. <laughs> I'm like, this is it. <laughs>
What the? That's no, that's not us. Dude. That's those girls. Well, they're all wearing gravity gear, so. That's what us. the heck? <laughs> we made it. We did oh it. Oh my gosh, that was sick. I think we're gonna have to start doing that more often, but we probably have to make more money first. <laughs> that's a hell of a way to travel. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hi. Hello. I'm Ben. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hi. You guys just go everywhere with Max? Oh my god. Yeah. 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 Five of us with him. <laughs> we, we have like a, a shitty excursion limo. Oh, so yeah. You got the Hummer limo too. Is this normally how you get picked up? Dude, I swear all limos smell the same. <laughs> they all do. Man, Max, you're so much more ahead of like any other 14 year old <laughs> this does feel a little weird being in a limo sober though so is this how you guys just like roll around going out to lunch and stuff max hops out and the rest follow i officially have no idea what's going on <laughs> my goodness so this is it huh gravity coffee corporate this is your place eh max yeah i think we got to go Max offered for one of us to drive the Lambo and he can't ever turn that down. You wanna know what's funny? Ben owns a Lambo and I haven't even driven it yet. And he's my cousin. You like this more than the Huracan? Yeah, 100%. Oh Should I sell my Huracan and have this for the winter? I would. Everyone can pile in, just like right now. Yeah, you got all the homies. Yeah, this is pretty sick, dude. Put in Corsa. Holy oh, crap, oh, dude. Frick. And that's with six people in this thing. Yeah. You can rip the cell pretty good right here. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> oh my, my god. gosh, dude. Jeez. Well, thank you for letting me drive us. Mike, dude. Mike. <laughs> Way I finally got to ride in a Lambo. <laughs> <laughs> was it everything you dreamed of? Yeah, Christina just, she goes, Micah, points in. I'm like, oh yeah, I put my bag. She goes, get in. I'm like, sure. Uh, yeah, now we're talking, yeah. dude. It's like a waterfall thing. Over there. <laughs> we gotta keep Mike under wraps, man. I know, Mike's gonna get too hammered and he's gonna embarrass us. I was thinking the same thing. Yeah. Water only for him. Yeah. Mike choked this dude. It's a bottle of water. Hello. Hey, Ben. Oh, hey, Mike. Okay, we're on to our fourth mode of transportation today. We started with the jet, then to the limo, then to the Lambo. Now boat. Now boat. Yeah. I'm finna find a new lane. I'm finna stand in the game. Tell him again and again. Homie, no, we are not friends. I go to Tokyo. They telling lies for Nokia. Shorty, she ride like rodeo. I get the dope and no overdose. I've been on the block like J-Lo. I seen devils out there ride halos. Before the come up, sometimes gotta lay low. Think about that like Play-Doh. Man, the world ain't fair, so I don't play by the rules. Thinking I move, I make a one and a two. Don't lay the guess in the soon. Hey, got a minute to find peace. Turn the skin like Ponzi. Washed up like laundry. From the east like Gandhi. Hard lay with the zombies. Going up now, part of me. Got hard work and my heart agrees. That hustle always been a part of me. What are we doing? Sounds like they have a chopper coming to pick us up. <laughs> it's so casual. All right, we're leaving location number two on the day. <laughs> I think we're going to catch a helicopter to go to a cabin. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's the plan. How's it going? Good. 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 How are you? Good. Uh, Howdy. Hello. What is ben. Ben. I'm Ken. Nice to meet you, Ken. Yeah, and this is Kenny. We left our Ken at home, so it's good to have another one. <laughs> Boys, we got our Ken for the day. Your name's Ken. Yes. Shut up. My name's Ken too. And Ken. What? You guys what? double Ken's. I mean, so. if you guys wow. get to Ken. Well, one of you guys might have to stay oh, back there. We can only handle <laughs> one Ken. <laughs> All right, I think we're in our fifth mode of transportation for the day. Helicopter. The only thing that could make this better is if Big Ken was here. He would love this shit. We're gonna enjoy this experience for Big Ken. To Big Ken, everybody. 
One, big two, can. three. Big, big can. can. <laughs> <laughs> What should we do next? <laughs> <laughs> so this is just the cabin? Yeah. All right, so they just brought us out to their cabin in the middle of the woods in Washington. And they could either kill us, and they've just been doing all this to like fatten us up, just like feeding pigs before they slaughter them. Or they're gonna continue to show us a good time. If you guys are watching this footage right now, I'm sure things worked out right. Uh, yesterday was probably I'd say the craziest day of my life and uh, I think today is going to continue on that same path but first off we're gonna wake up Micah let's do it <laughs> <laughs> little Max was like dude I really want to wake up Micah I'm like well just wait till tomorrow and we'll be able to do it <laughs> just part of the sea boys experience first thing in the morning shows up with a bowl of ice water <laughs> Good morning, Mike. I hate you. That was so much water. <laughs> oh, dude. Sorry, Mike. We'll let you go back to bed. We'll see you in a couple hours. Thank you, sir. I do have to give it to Mike. He is a good sport about it, you know? Like, all the times that he's gotten woken up in every way that he has, he's never really been mad about it. You do that to never. anyone else? Honestly, you do that to me? I'd probably be pretty pissed. But Mike, good sport. How does the dude just sleep in a bottle? <laughs> I died this one! Mike kind of came up hot there. <laughs> he did. All right, Mike, the first one was the snooze and you hit it. Now it's actually time to wake up. Let's do it. Let's do it, Mike. We got a busy day ahead of us. Yeah, I like where this is going. All right, so to make sense of this, basically, Big Max goes, hey, so we got this old snowmobile sitting in the woods. It doesn't run. I think we should pick it up with the helicopter and drop it. And we were like, that sounds like a great idea, Max. I think we should. Yeah, so shout out Max <laughs> for donating his sled because he's like, I was going to fix it, but I think this will be better. It's Ken again. This guy's such a beauty. Hey, Ken. Hey, how are you? I'm doing good. How you doing? Good. You guys have a good time? Yeah. Time? We did. It looks like it'd be a great time for everyone. We're dropping a snowmobile out here? That's what I've heard. So what's like the logistics of this? So we have a hundred foot line 
yep. with a hook that has an electronic release on it. So, yeah, so right when he is, pushes right. the button up on the controls of the aircraft, the that hook just lets it go. Have you ever dropped a snowmobile from it? I don't think he ever has dropped a snowmobile. We, so this is this is a first? Yeah, I think this is a first for both of us. Yeah. Yeah, we, okay. John is going to be in charge of rigging the snowmobile. Okay. And so um, there'll be a lot of people talking. You can ignore a lot of them. Like Whatever you do, do not listen to the idiots in the white over there. Max Senior is just like, oh, are these trees in the way? Those ones over there. And he's like, oh, hold on a minute, I'll take them down. Actually? Yeah. He, he wasn't kidding. Well, I think we got a pretty good view now. All right, if we're gonna be dropping this snowmobile, we're gonna need a target, so we're gonna make one right now. Are you springy? <laughs> What's the reward if it gets like dead center? If he hits the green, it's a thousand dollars. Thousand bucks? Thousand dollars. Dude, it was so close to the green. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, this is insane. <laughs> Straight up 90 this plug. Look at that. Honestly, it's like flattened like a pancake, but also it like held together pretty good. Yeah, I mean, besides for being squished, it's still in one piece. Tell the pilot don't work nothing. I think we gotta go again. Go round two on it. I don't think liability insurance is high enough for round two. Let's just <laughs> cut it. Nice to meet you too, dude. Yeah. Thank you for everything. You guys showed some hospitality for sure. This one's gonna be tough to beat. Right. Right, Thanks, bye. guys. See, See ya. Guys. Bye, everybody. Bye. Oh, man. Holy. That was so fun. Good to see you. All right, guys, we're back on the PJ. This will probably be our last PJ flight, at least for a little while. Hopefully, <laughs> not too long. I'm headed home. These three are headed to Gold Creek to go meet up with Evan and our buddy David to go do another extreme dirt biking video. So they're gonna be riding the hardest trails in the world, or at least in America. So be ready for that. Thank you to both the Maxes and Gravity Coffee. That was a crazy weekend and uh hit the subscribe button we'll see you guys whenever we see you next <laughs>